What is going on everybody? My name is Pete, but you probably already knew that. But in case you didn't, you guys are watching the one and only Paid to Drive. And of course, Paid to Drive Vlogs coming at you with another new video. Hope you're doing great out there. If you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you, my friends, should hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And of course, don't forget to hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. And uh, of course, let's uh, let's jump on into this. So uh, I don't think I've ever made a video on this topic before. So I believe this is a first for my channel. Uh, Labor Day, okay? I've been trying to cover more of the holidays, especially the American holidays. Um, and I just want to, you know, talk about my experience working on Labor Day. Um, it really follows the trend of a lot of other holidays, you know, like Fourth of July or, you know, just you know, other other assorted holidays where basically people's uh, attention is elsewhere, you know, other than like a normal weekend or just a normal day of the week. Um, some things to keep in mind. OK, and. I've noticed this just from working Labor Day in the past, is breakfast time is usually a very busy time uh, because people are getting ready for barbecues and having people over or getting ready to go somewhere. And, you know, they don't want to be thinking about having to make breakfast or whatever, or maybe lunch or whatever. So breakfast and lunch tends to be relatively busy, at least in my market. Remember the golden rule, every market is different. So always keep that in mind. Um, and with that being said, dinner time may be slower than usual, okay? And again, this is just coming from my own personal experiences. Um, there have been times when I've worked a holiday and my market was super slow and I would go on to social media, I would check YouTube, I would check Facebook groups and stuff and people are posting their earnings saying, I'm making $300 today. And it's like, dude, I can't even break 40. What are you doing? You know, it all matters where you work, how busy it is, you know, and, and how many people are observing that holiday, you know, is really what it comes down to. The, of course, there will always be people that do not observe really any holidays. Uh, you know, whether it's a religious reason or, you know, just they don't have a lot of family or friends or whatever. I mean, it is a reality. So those people might still be ordering as if it's reg any regular ordinary day. So these are things to keep on, keep in mind really for any holiday, obviously some more than others, you know, like, uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas and, uh, New Year's and things like that. The more, I guess, like major holidays, you know what I mean? If you want to call it that. Um, but you know, like things like 4th of July, Labor Day, you know, Veterans Day and stuff like that, those types of holidays may not be observed by everybody. And I'm not, I'm not trying to say, oh, you know, you know, I'm not trying to put one down over the other. I'm just saying in terms of busyness from my own personal experiences, uh, you know, that's just what it comes down to. So, um, use your discretion. If you, I always, I always make this suggestion to everybody. If you can take the day off for yourself, take the day off for yourself. And the reason why I say that is because when I first started for the first like year and a half, I worked every single day. So that was seven days a week. Uh, and I would usually put in anywhere from 10 to 12 hours and burnout is real. You will burn yourself out. Sure, you'll be making thousands of dollars. You'll be running your car into the ground. You'll be doing maintenance like crazy. You'll be doing oil changes like crazy. You'll be doing tire rotations like crazy and stuff. But, you know, eventually it's like, are you living to work or working to live? You know, you really have to consider those things. That's why the holidays are, are there, you know, as a day of rest for you. And, you know, some people might say, well, Pete, I'm hurting for money and I, I don't I don't have time to rest because I'm telling you, you're, you're going to burn yourself out. It happens. It happened to me. And also not to mention, I lost friends from it, too. You know, I remember when I first started, you know, friends would say, hey, come by for dinner or, you know, uh, let's hang out or something. And I'm like, no, I'm working. I'm working. I'm working. They're like, are you ever not working? And I'm like, no, I'm always working. So just, you know taking some advice from someone who's been doing this for four years now, uh, take time for yourself. Okay. Recuperate, 
spend some time with friends and family. Or if that's not an option for you, just enjoy yourself, relax, stay home, sleep in. You know, uh, I know again, I know that goes against some people's daily standards, but sometimes you need to loosen up a little bit and just kind of stop and look at the world a little, you know? So when it comes to Labor Day, when it comes to most holidays, breakfast and lunch typically tend to be uh, busier in my area just because people, like I said, they're distracted, they're setting things up for a party or whatever, and dinner might be slower than usual. So in the comments, in the chat, let me know how was your Labor Day if you worked? And also, did you work? Or are you taking the day off? Let me know down below. And if you guys ever want to send me anything for a video or just have a question, email me at paidtodrivestories at gmail.com. Best place to reach me. Or you can uh, get a quicker response if you message me through Patreon at patreon.com slash paid to drive. All right, everybody. Um, so I have a link in the description or in the pin top comment if you want to sign up on there. Uh, Anyone who signs up, I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos. So I'm gonna do that right now. When you hear your name called, say, hey Pete, I heard my name. We've got Ari Rosenbaum, our $100 Ultimate Driver. We've got Samantha Michaels, uh, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Ivan Jerome Gilroy, Joe Valerio, Angela Counts McCarty, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreaux. Laura Love, Agus, Tom Perry, Alan G. Van Horn, Lawrence Brown, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Havilland, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Joyce Hine, Brian Richardson, Kenny Bess, Ginny Thomas, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Matt, uh, Nick G., Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, and Valerie Brown. Huge shout outs to all of them. Sign up down below. Links in the description of the pin top comment. And of course, please everybody at the bottom of the description, download the Get Upside gas app. I tell you every day, stop procrastinating. Make sure to use it. You can save money on gas. You download it for free with the link down below in the description. Go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside uh, gas app. And uh, within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description. Make sure to download it today. And uh, yeah, guys, if you want to get one of these awesome Get That Money, Get That Honey t-shirts, you can get one at paytodrivestore.com where everything is on sale every day. We have lots of different designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We have it. Uh, maybe get your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies, pay to drive store.com. And of course, if you made it to the end of this video, leave a comment saying end one, one, zero E N D one, one, zero. Just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications. And, uh, yeah, that's right. Hit that like button. Just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. And until next time, Get that money, get that honey, keep hustling and keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and Paid to Drive Vlogs. And uh, yeah, that's that, everybody. That is that. So as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Good luck out there.